Hi, welcome to our estate sale preview this week. This week we are doing an estate sale at Northwest 63rd and Meridian on Kingswood Drive. And we're going to start the preview off in the master bedroom. Over here we have a Futura sewing machine and it has the matching cabinet and the little chair. We also have a king size bedroom suit. It is made by the White Furniture Company and it has an armoire. We also have the pair of matching nightstands, a king size headboard, and the dresser with the mirror up on top. We also have this nice little blue uh, chair. And a, a older JVC TV with Entertainment Center. And kind of the highlight of this room is she had purchased two months before she passed away a brand new memory foam king size bed. And it is just absolutely spotless. It's perfect. The really wonderful bed. And the king size linens are really nice that match it. And as you can tell throughout the video, this house, she didn't have any pets. So everything's nice and clean. No smoke smell. Nothing weird. So it's a really nice cell to come to. And in the guest bedroom, this bedroom set is by American Drew. It is a queen size bedroom set. We've got the chest of drawers, an iron bed or bench that goes with the foot of a bed, nice blue velvet wingback chair. We have this vanity and as you can see from this little center section on the vanity, this will lift up and when it does there's a mirror on the inside and you keep makeup in it. These were really trendy at one time, uh, really kind of cool and fun. We have this mirror that goes to the vanity up on top and the little matching nightstand, headboard, and a queen size mattress, which also I don't think has ever probably been slept in. Very nice, very clean, as everything through the cell is. Next thing I'm gonna take you on, or next thing I'm gonna show you is this little console table. It's got a marble top, uh, it's a cute little console table for the entryway. In the dining room, We've got a Baldwin Acrosonic Piano. As you know, Baldwin Acrosonic Pianos are really good quality, really nice pianos. For a console piano, this is probably one of the better ones that most people uh, go after. We have some original artwork. This is an original painting of Still Life. We also have some Blue Danube China. The Blue Danube China. We have several rare pieces. Um, as you can see, these are the oversized mugs. And this is a standard mug, so you can see how much larger these oversized mugs are. These are usually pretty well soft after because they're really hard to find. The standard mugs are also kind of hard to find. And we also have the, the Fantastic, the Gravy Boat, uh, some of the serving pieces. These are really, if you collect it, there's some neat pieces here to have. Then we have some other little random pieces. We've got a piece of um, Wedgwood. We've got some Fostoria. We've got some Fiesta. In the other room, we've got Norman Rockwell plates and also the matching Norman Rockwell figurines. Some more little decorative items. And we have some crystal and an absolutely outstanding uh, crystal uh, punch bowl. So if you're going to do a wedding, this would be a stunning piece. If you're going to do a wedding for a centerpiece, it's monumental size. It's hard to tell from the video, but this is a really big punch bowl. And we've got several little serving plates. As you know, this is the wedding season, so now's the time to get crystal. We over here have an American by Martinsville. This is a little uh, liquor server. It's on wheels, so you can kind of roll it around like a little cart. The center will open up, and when it opens up, it's coated with Formica, and that will keep the liquor or alcohol from affecting the finish. So this will fold all the way out and actually make a much larger cart. And it has a cute little drawer. And we're going to go into the living room. The living room, the furniture is fairly new. It wasn't too long ago that she purchased it. We have a pair of matching chairs and a single ottoman. These are really, really pretty chairs. And don't see the brand on those. The little end tables are Drexel Heritage. I did look for those. And we've got uh, three Drexel Heritage plus the coffee tables, also Drexel. We have another original art piece and tons of books. Some of it's encyclopedias, but some of it's more interesting. 
We also have some DVDs, some CDs, some VHS tapes. With this really adorable little magazine rack, we have this little ottoman, which would great, be great in the middle of a room. We've got some brass accessories and some nice little knickknacks. Over here we have more books. And this is one of the curio cabinets that's full of the Franklin or the uh, the Norman Rockwell. The Norman Rockwell figurines, as you can see, we have the figurine that matches the plate behind it, which is kind of cool. There's eight figurines and eight plates, plus another separate figurine we don't have the matching plate for. We also have some older rhythm and blues records. The uh, sofa and chair, oversized chair with ottoman, are almost brand new. And that's the ottoman that fits up into the chair. You can also use it as kind of as a coffee table if you just want to float it in between the two. And that's the sofa. They're really nice, really comfy. I've been sitting on them as I've been uh, looking up stuff, so really can vouch for their, them being comfortable. Uh, this is another Drexel table, oversized big brass lamp, another oil painting. And this is a heritage coffee table, one of those big square ones from the 80s. It's really nice. Then over here we've got a lot of costume jewelry. Some of the costume jewelry is normal. Some of it is actually a little bit nicer. There's a lot of little rhinestone pieces, so it's kind of some, some fun stuff to kind of dig through. There's a pair of these. These are tall, probably about two and a half feet tall. These are Italian statues. They have separate little bases. They're really good quality. And there's this mirror, which is from Spain. It's uh, I have almost the identical mirror at home. These are, were really expensive when they were new. They have really, they were really nice. I mean, they were on the level of Labarge when they were produced. They have a 1920s, maybe 1930s little table that has the black Egyptian marble inset into the top. And here's the other curio cabinet with the Norman Rockwell figurines. We're not going to go outside, but we do have a patio table. That's the rectangular patio table with the chairs. You know, as you know, we don't often get rectangular. Usually people have round. There's also a round set in the backyard too, and a ton of yard tools. In the kitchen, we have this little tile top table with the four matching chairs. We also have, it's almost two kitchens worth of stuff. The kitchen kind of goes around, there's a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, lots and lots of kitchen wares, as you can see. And then the kitchen goes around this other side, and there's a whole other kitchen on this side too. So lots of kitchen wares, there's some Magnolite stuff. There's KitchenAid accessories, as far as if you have a KitchenAid mixer. We have some white milk glass. We've got some lots of colored glassware that's over here. And lots, some little vintage stuff. So some really neat stuff, so you definitely want to check it out. And we're going to go into the garage. We have a dryer over here, and over here a much newer washing machine. And I believe these are both Kenmore's. In the garage, oddly enough, remember when I was telling you about the almost brand new mattress in the master bedroom? This mattress is brand new. It's never been opened or out of the sleeve. She bought it, got it home, slept on it one night, didn't like it. She called the mattress company. They wouldn't take it back, so she went and bought a new mattress anyway. This mattress has never been slept on. It was brand new. I think they said she paid $2,000 or $2,500 for it when she bought it new. Never even got to use it. It's been wrapped up here ever since about six months ago, which is when um, she bought it. And then she slept on the other one for two months and then passed away. So, like I said, it's a great deal if you need a brand new king-size mattress. We've got, starting over here, lots of uh, uh, handy accessories. We have an electric wheelchair, and what's neat about this one is there's the controller over here, and then on the back side, there is a whole other separate controller. So, if someone can push you with a controller too, you don't have to do it all yourself. I've never seen that setup before on a chair yet. And over here, we've got three tables full of hand tools, lots of miscellaneous wrenches, vice grips, tons of hammers, saws, kind of you name it. And on this table, 
a lot of little miscellaneous stuff. As you can tell, we have bad, bad lighting because it's getting towards the end of the day. And then a few more tools kind of spread out throughout it. We've got some chemicals and stuff. Then we have over here some Christmas decor, some weights, miscellaneous office stuff. And then over there, we've got a, this is one of those electric lifts that, you know, it's a, it's a mobility lift that will get you out of bed into a wheelchair and back again. It has a battery backup. It's really kind of a neat little piece. We have a potty chair, a couple of walkers. I believe we have three wheelchairs stuck in there. And there's the other couple of wheelchairs and a hospital chair. So if you know anyone who needs any mobility accessories, there, we've got a whole bunch of them this week. We've also got this file cabinet that has the lock and the keys, neat little workbench, and a whole lot of Christmas decor. And that pretty much sums up our sale, so make sure you come out and take a look at it. It's really going to be a fun sale. Also this week, Brad is doing a sale in Crown Heights, and as you know, Crown Heights sales are always fun, even if you just go to look at the house. So make sure to check our sale out, and also go by and do a look at his. Bye-bye.